Hello Cancer, welcome to your next 48 to 72 hours reading. So Cancer, these messages are timeless. Whenever you click on the video, that's when the messages could resonate the most. This is also a general reading, so not everything is going to apply. Just take what does and leave the rest. I'm going to go ahead and pull on you some energy. Spirit, give me some messages for Cancer. Messages for Cancer, what is okay? Cancer. So I have pen, new job slash career. Wow, and then I have January. All right, Cancer. So all right, we are in the month of January. So something definitely could be happening this month concerning your career here. I'm hearing promoted. Let's get some energy on pen. Why is Pin here for Cancer? What is the message? Okay. Ooh, the Ten of Cups in the reverse and the Two of Swords. So somebody um is trying to make a decision about walking away from a relationship. This is somebody that they definitely could have a family with. I feel like with the Four of Pentacles to the Six of Wands, this person wishes to be anywhere else, but with who they are currently with. It's like this person dreams about having victory and success outside of this connection. Somebody's not happy. Somebody feels like they're being breadcrumbed. There's no equal give and take here with the Six of Pentacles. And it's like somebody's in agony here about this connection. I'm telling you, it's like suffering in silence. Give me an energy on the Ten of Cups in the reverse. Why is the Ten of Cups in the reverse here? The nine of wands. Yeah, somebody's putting up their guard. For some of you, this is definitely a marriage here. The Hierophant, Taurus energy. I'm telling you, it's almost like somebody just envisioned two of wands, like what it would be like not to be connected to someone. Like what life would be like without being married or in some type of relationship with this person. Somebody feels like they'll be more at peace. Give me another energy on the Ten of Cups. Why is the Ten of Cups here? What is the message? The King of Cups. So for some of you, this could be you, Cancer, or another water sign. But yeah, somebody has their guard up. I feel like somebody's also healing right now as well. Give me another energy on the Two of Swords. Why is the Two of Swords here? The Devil. So I feel like somebody's just trying to keep you or this other person confused, stuck, keep them investing into a family dynamic, keep building, growing. Yeah, they're doing this intentionally. Somebody's definitely in a karmic energy here with this devil Capricorn. Somebody could have Capricorn highly aspected. Cancer, this is your north node. Give me an energy for the two of swords. Why is the two of swords here? the star I'm just getting that this person sell dreams like this person tries to make you or this other energy energy believe that things are going to be different I've changed and it's like this person always falls for it or you always fall for a cancer and you end up taking this person back but I feel like somebody's saying no more somebody's setting up firm boundaries here give me an energy on the nine of wands why is the nine of wands here for cancer? What is the message? The page of wands. Yeah, somebody's starting over here. Somebody's ready for a new beginning. I'm telling you, somebody's in the planning stages. Two of wands. Give me another energy on the nine of wands. Why is the nine of wands here for cancer? What is the message? behind it um this person is definitely being secret about their plans what they um are going to take action towards but somebody's taking a leap of faith aquarius energy this is giving me the energy that this person is no longer allowing this other energy or you cancer this could be you and this devil energy um to hold them back somebody seeing the situation for what it is, and that's because they are doing the healing. Give me another energy on the King of Cups. Why is the King of Cups here for Cancer? What is the message? The Ace of Wands. 
Yeah, so this is just giving me somebody's no longer taking action when it comes to this connection. They went within and they realized that they need to protect themselves from whoever they're with. Somebody's realizing that they're being manipulated here, emotionally manipulated, spirit is saying. Give me an energy on the devil. Why is the devil here? What is the message? The page of pentacles i'm just getting offer i feel like this person tries to keep you stuck um by catering to your strongholds your addictions especially where this person know like you're not strong enough to resist if you have like i'm hearing gambling drinking problem like this person will be like oh you know would you like, you know, a cup of wine or, you know, alcohol? You want to go to the casino? Like, somebody is egging you on here to continue down a toxic path. And they do this as a means to control you. Give me an energy on the devil. Why is the devil here? What is the message? Why is the devil here? The Hierophant. Taurus energy. I feel like for some of you, you definitely offered a commitment to this person. You're married to someone who is in a karmic energy. Give me another message for the higher fence. The seven of wands to the tower, Scorpio energy. But I feel like you have your guard up. You're protecting yourself. And that's the tower. For some of you, this person never thought that you were going to pull back your energy and mean it. And I'm hearing this time because for someone, you kept taking this person back, going back and forth. I'm actually hearing Aaliyah back, back, forth and forth. Yeah, you always gave this person another chance, Page of Pentacles. You were always willing to start over. Give me an energy on the star. And that's how this person was able to manipulate you. Tell me more about the star. Why is the star here? The Knight of Pentacles and the Knight of Cups. So for some of you, I feel like there's somebody that you want to go towards. You can see this person in this star energy. This person could get a lot of attention. You can have a lot of admiration for this person. But I feel like you want to come in and offer something stable. It may have taken you a long time to get to this person. You definitely were not in a rush. But you, offer, you want to make a love offer. To this other energy give me a message for the knight of cups why is the knight of cups here for cancer what is the message yeah the two of wands so you're choosing a new path here something that's going to offer you more that you feel is going to benefit you here cancer strength card you're taking back your power you're fully in control um and then i'm hearing limelight somebody could do something um in entertainment or could have a career where there's a lot of public exposure. Give me an energy for the Knight of Pentacles. Why is the Knight of Pentacles here? What is the message? Yep, the Six of Wands. I feel like you're ready to make a long-term investment. You feel like you'll have victory and success with someone else. Or for some of you, if this isn't even about you choosing another person, you will just have more success in life by getting away from this toxic situation and going down a path that is destined for you. You know that victory lies ahead. You know that peace, blessings lie before you when you're on the right path. Give me an energy on the page of Pentacles. Why is the Page of Pentacles here for Cancer? What is the message? Yep, the wheel. Sagittarius, Leo, Taurus, Scorpio, energy. I feel like for some of you, this person looks at you as fortunate. Something has to do with fortune as well. Like, will of fortune, but fortune is what stands out to me. So I feel like this person... um. They sort of see you as their savior, so to speak. 
when it comes to their stability, finances. You could always give to this person, but I feel like you're holding back seven of wands. Give me another energy on the page of pentacles. Why is the page of pentacles here for cancer? What is the message? Yep, the ten of swords. Yeah, so you're done. Something's over. You're walking away. This is, a, this is the closing of a cycle here. Eight of cups. You're leaving the past in the past finally. I feel like for some of you, you definitely missed out on an opportunity in the past because you were giving to this person. You missed out on your blessing. You walked away from what God was trying to give you. To balance the situation out with somebody else. Give me an energy on the Ace of Wands. Why is the Ace of Wands here for Cancer? I'm telling you the world and strength. This cycle's over. I'm telling you. And this person means it. Like this person is meaning what they say. Saying what they mean is done. Like there's no going back. Somebody's ready for the new. A new job. New career. Somebody's ready for a new experience. That's what this is. Pen. That pinch may hurt, but it's necessary. For some of you, I'm also hearing write down. There's some things that you may need to jot down, like your plans, your goals. Somebody could be thinking about creating a vision board here. Give me an energy on January. Watch January here for Cancer. Before Pentacles in the reverse. Give me another energy for January. What is the message? The moon and the queen of swords in the reverse. Wow. So somebody could be vicious with their tongue here. Somebody's also a liar. But this person says whatever comes to their mind, they, they don't care how it comes out and how much it hurts. The moon in the reverse, Pisces, Cancerian energy. So there's definitely some secrets that are coming out. Give me an energy on the four of pentacles. Why is the four of pentacles here for cancer? The queen of wands. Give me another energy on the four of pentacles. Why is the four of pentacles here? The seven of pentacles. So yeah, cancer, you want to give to somebody else. You want to invest. For some of you, this is a queen of wands energy. This could be somebody that has fire highly aspected. Leo, Tor Leo. Aries, Sagittarius, or somebody that just embodies the Queen of Wands energy. This is who you're attracted to here. You want to give to this person. You want to be fully open. Give me another energy for the Queen of Swords in the reverse. Why is Queen of Swords here? For some of you, I'm hearing reach out. You may be contacting this person. Or Cancer, this energy is going to be contacting you. Three of Wands. I feel like somebody's trying to think of how to slow you down here. How to slow this connection down. Yeah, from coming together. Somebody has plans here. For some of you, somebody could be doing some energy manipulation. Because I just heard spell book. By looking at this girl holding this book open. But somebody's trying to come up with some type of ideas to slow this union down. Give me an energy on the Queen of Swords. In the reverse. What is the message? For some of you, this person may even try to come to your home. Cancer. Ten of Wands. Yeah, somebody's getting left. That's what this is. Somebody's dropping the burdens. Why is the three of wands here? What is the message? Why is the three of wands here for cancer? The three of pentacles. So the number three, 33 could be significant. Give me the energy on the ten of wands. The four of wands. Give me one more on the three of wands. Why is the three of wands here? The six of swords. So this is somebody moving on. Going to build with somebody else. Somebody that they see a future with. They want a family with. Yeah, somebody's dropping the baggage. But I feel like whoever this queen of swords is. Thank you, spirit. This person has a lot to say. And it's not nice. Um, I'm actually hearing like nice, nasty. So, you know, when somebody is trying to make it appear as if they're being nice when they say something, but it's not, you know, it's being condescending here. 
um, to hit below the belt. I feel like this person is saying that you're a home wrecker. Mm -hmm. Somebody is blaming you for ruining their relationship. Yeah, this is giving me like home wrecker vibes here. Yeah, somebody's saying you ruined their connection. The person left them to go build with you, have a family with you. You know, you came in between this marriage. You came in between this relationship. They're blaming you. For some of you, this person is jealous of how attractive you are. Give me energy on the moon. Why is the moon here? What is the message? Somebody could have moved out already this month. This masculine or feminine, take it as it resonates, moved out already. This was a tower moment for someone. Give me energy on the moon. Why is the moon in the reverse? Temperance, Sagittarius energy. So something's coming out in divine timing here. Give me another energy on the moon. The Eight of Wands, I'm telling you, something's coming out. Some type of message, communication. Give me an energy on temperance. Why is temperance here for cancer? What is the message? Ooh, we, we have both the king and queen of cups. So this is your person, your divine partner here. So I feel like um, cancer, where things have been like very slow between you and this person, y'all may not even be in communication. All of a sudden, things are going to pick up quick. Things are going to take off quick between you and this other energy where there has been like dead silence, stagnation, just all out of the blue. Things are going to start taking off. Give me an energy on the Eight of Wands. There's definitely going to be... <coughs> There's definitely going to be a lot of communication. Give me an energy on Eight of Wands. I feel like both of you are in the energy of healing. You have the Three of Swords. Listen, it's going to leave somebody else heartbroken. For some of you, part of this person's karma for trying to hold on to this masculine the way she did because this person used heavy manipulation, trying to keep this person stuck in their head. Part of this person's karma is to see you and this masculine come together. For some of you, yeah, she may have to watch this online as well as hear about this. But yeah, somebody's going to be tormented here. Seeing you and this person be back together. Come into this union. Somebody was a blockage here. Give me an energy on the Eight of Wands. Yep, death and rebirth in the chariot. This person is also talking a lot. Telling people all different things. But they're just trying to avoid the inevitable. Like somebody doesn't want to deal with the fact that they're getting left. Scorpio energy to the chariot. Yeah. Somebody wants to avoid this change. They don't want to get left behind. Why is death in the reverse? Why wow, the nine of pentacles in the reverse? Because somebody's codependent. Somebody's unstable financially. That's why. This person is trying to hold on. They're so invested here into this situation. It's because of the money. Yeah, somebody um, is not stable whatsoever. Give me an energy on the chariot. Somebody could have also um, purchased a new vehicle, a new car, and then I'm hearing repo. So somebody's car could be getting repossessed. Give me an energy on the chariot. Why is the chariot here? What is the message? Yep, the King of Wands. Yeah, this fire sign here. Leo Aries, Sagittarius. Heavy on the Leo and Sagittarius energy. He's moving forward. He's leaving this person to deal with her own problems. I heard a long time. So this energy has been like supporting this person, helping this person for a while. And now somebody's being left with their own burdens. That's what this is. She tried to put her burdens off on this masculine energy. But it's like, no, now that this masculine has taken back his power, it's like, no, here, you carry your burdens and I'll carry mine. Somebody is having no other choice but to be accountable for their own life here. Give me one on the Three of Pentacles. Why is the Three of Pentacles here for Cancer? What is the message? Yeah. Oh, yeah. We have, yeah, this is your person. We have the King and Queen of Wands, King and Queen of Cups. This is your counterpart. I feel like both of you are action oriented. Both of you are go getters, are dreamers. You create, you manifest. 
Yep. The Eight of Swords. This person is all up in their head here about this person investing in you, giving to you, leaving. Like, this is all that this energy can think about. This Queen of Swords in the reverse is you and this person being together. Like, somebody is literally obsessed with both of your lives. They're obsessed with you and this person coming together. And they want to block this. Like, I'm hearing creator. Somebody wants to play God in you and this other energy's life. That's what this is. Something definitely has taken... I'm hearing move out. So somebody has moved out or will be moving out. But somebody's getting left out in the cold. January this month. Spirits say 2023. 2 plus 3 is 5. There's about to be a significant change. Somebody is saying out with the old and with the new. Somebody can actually have a new job. And then I'm hearing, re I'm hearing relocation. Somebody may have to move for this job. But it's like, this is all divine intervention. Somebody's being pushed to get away from this person. This manipulation here. Let's get a final message. Give me one on the world. Give me one on the world and then I'll close out. Why is the world here for cancer? Why is the world here? What is the message? The king of pentacles in reverse so for some of you this person lost a lot yeah somebody lost their stability they experienced some changes here when it came to their finances they could have also had a child with this person the empress libra towards energy knight of wands the sun give me one more on the world why is the world here for cancer the eight of cups yeah, this person walking away. Because somebody's seeing like they're not stable. Like somebody lost a lot of their stability by being in this connection. Now, for some of you, this is going to be for a very few. Once this person lost all of their money and they could no longer take care of this other energy, she left. So for some of you... This queen of swords in the reverse was the one that walked away because this masculine, you know, he, he became unstable when it came to his finances. He could no longer take care of her, support her, you know, pay her bills, give her money. So she ended up walking away. But for others of you, no, it's this masculine. He said, uh-uh, no, I can't do this. I can't be unstable. I, I can't lose it all. This person is also realizing they risked it all by being with this person. For some of you going back to this person, give me one more on the King of Pentacles in the reverse. Why is the King of Pentacles in the reverse? The Fool. Yeah, I feel like somebody's taking a leap. I'm also getting with this King of Pentacles in the reverse. Somebody's going through a divorce or may have already gotten divorced. For those of you where this was a marriage and now they're ready to move forward. This cycle is over. Yeah, somebody definitely had to juggle their finances, their stability. Ten of Pentacles to the Two of Pentacles. Trying to stay afloat. For some of you, I'm hearing living this lifestyle. This person, you know, was used to a certain lifestyle. So they definitely did not want to downgrade whatsoever. So let's get a final message. Spirit, give me a final message for Cancer. What is the energy? Give me a final message for Cancer. Oh, watch your words, Parrot Spirit. So I feel like for some of you, this Queen of Swords in the reverse spoke this into existence because this person is very negative. I'm also hearing this person also talked about you all the time as well. So her words pretty much called this union back together. And that's confirmation. At the bottom of the deck, you, the number 45, 4 or 5, or 9 could be significant. Something could have happened on the 9th. And then I have Rhino Spirit, overcome any obstacle. Yeah, I feel like this situation is just teaching this person how strong they are. And then I'm hearing bully. Like, this person could have also tried to bully this masculine as well to stay with them. Threaten this masculine. But I'm telling you... Somebody has taken back their power. Somebody's realizing just how strong they are. Somebody's also using their intuition as well. 
Yeah, this person is realizing like they don't have to stay stuck in something that makes them miserable. Yeah, this person has the spirit of an overcomer. Or you do, Cancer. Take it as it resonates. But this is your reading. Stay true to thyself and real with thyself. Grow with me as I grow with you. And for some of you, um, this person's finances are going to improve because they are they do have a new job. Somebody has a new position here that pays them more money. So they are going to be working to get back on their feet. Or for some of you, they may have already started this job and they're in the process of rebuilding their finances. But this King of Pentacles is definitely going to turn to the upright because it's like they're no longer in that low vibrational energy. So they're able to attract what it is that they actually want. So again, stay true to thyself, real with thyself, grow with me as I grow with you. Stay blessed.